you know, I had Lyme's disease. Do I have any of the neurological complications? You know, we don't see this a whole lot in the South. And usually when we do, we miss it. You know, Lyme's disease is caused by a tick bite, usually three to 30 days after tick bite. People get fever, chills, body aches, and neck stiffness. You know, the, if you see that little, you know, pimple from where the tick bit you, it's just so important to get treated as quick as possible. If it's untreated, then you can have neurological complications later. I won't go through all the testing for Lyme's disease, but what are the main things that we've seen? Well, the most common things that we've seen in our practice are like radiculopathies, back pain, but you can get the whole gauntlet of symptoms. You can get like an aseptic meningitis, you can get cranial nerve problem, you get a Bell's palsy, peripheral nerve problem, numbness and weakness of the limbs, peripheral neuropathy, you can even get cognitive defects. You know, there's no real treatment for the neurological complications of Lyme's disease. The treatment is acutely if you get bit by a tick, get treated. Positive antibodies to Lyme can remain forever and they don't really tell when you're infected or not or how long you've been affected. Um, so neurological complications of Lyme's disease is not fun. So if you're bit by a tick, watch that tick bite. If you get a little pimple, a little zit on it, then go in and get some antibiotics. Usually doxycycline, I'm not up to speed on what they treat with now because I'm a neurologist and we don't really use a lot of antibiotics. But that's the neurological complications of Lyme's disease. Like, comment, subscribe. More later.